This is an area of the TT Grandstand not many people get to see. We're up in the control room, the nerve centre of the event. And today, some school children from Williston are being shown round. And it gave me a chance to talk to people involved in the event. Of course, if you think about it, the TT will be here before you know it. I think it's the 25th, 23rd, 25th of, of May we start. Uh, of course, it doesn't start here. It starts uh, down in my end of the woods, down at, uh, at Balloon with the pre-TT Classic. But mm. um, we know we're, we're here that weekend, so uh, it's, it's all happening. Now, this is an area that not, not a lot of people obviously get to see. We're in the control area. Do, do tell us what goes on here. In this particular room, this is the nerve centre of the, of the whole event, really. Um, we control all of the riders and people that's out on the circuit. We are in constant touch with all the marshals. And if anything happens out on the circuit, all the information comes into this control room. And those can be some tough decisions to go, not to go. You know, there's so many different things now to take into account for the safety of the riders. It is very difficult. Uh, the clerk of the course has a great responsibility um, because he has to decide whether, A, the course is fit for racing uh, due to the, to, to the weather or whatever, whatever. Um, and he is the one that has to say whether it goes or stops. Of course, that is your duty for Manx Grand Prix. Yes, for the Manx Grand Prix, that, that, that problem falls on my shoulders, yes. Challenging? A little bit. Um, I have been uh, clerk of the course at the Southern 100 for a long time, but um, coming into Douglas here and taking over on the mountain circuit was a, a big eye-opener. We have ten more, ten times the problems on the TT course that we have at Balloon, so it was an eye-opener, yes. Now, I suppose this doesn't get overused, this sort of area, does it? But there is a bit of an upgrade going on at the moment, I understand. Yes, we're, we're always trying to improve the system, and I have to say that the department who are responsible for the grandstand are great. They are, are making things happen for us. It um, gets very noisy in here during a race session, and uh, a lot of complaints from some of the marshals that uh, they can't hear what's going on because of the noise in the room, and uh, we in here complain because we can't hear because of the noise of the bikes. So they're trying to um, set the thing up slightly different for us so that uh, it improves the system all around. And as I say, we've got some school children coming around today, so this is, this is great for them to learn the, the background to what goes on behind the scenes. It is. Who knows? We might have a, a future clerk of the course coming up here in a few minutes to have a look around to see what's going on. So, yes, it's, it's always great to encourage younger people to come in. It's one of the problems that the, the all sporting yeah. events seem to have these days. There's no interest in organising, and uh, the more people we can get involved in, the better.